Hey team, it's Grace from Graceful Bricks, and uh, I have not done a video in, well, it's September now, and I don't think I've done a video since probably June, maybe July, I don't know when. Uh, and the reasons for that are simple. I've been sick. And for the most part, I'm not talking physically. I mean, my mental health has gone down, 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 way down. Um, I, I had like a good week or two in there. Uh, but, you know, then I went and mentioned that I was having a good week. And just like when you say, you know, at least it couldn't get worse than this. Yeah, it, uh, the good didn't last. Let's say that. Um, I'm not sleeping regularly. It's like nine o'clock at night. And I think I woke up probably around... 5 or 6 p.m. Um, I'm going to bed like sometimes around midnight, sometimes 3, sometimes 5, 6, 7 a.m. Sometimes I wait and I stay up and I say goodbye to my partner and they go off to work at uh, around 7.30 in the morning. I'm not really eating. Um, yeah, my diet's all sorts of screwy. Um, so that, there's that. I am taking my meds. I take my meds regularly. Um, and, and that's a key part of my existence. But, uh, yeah, it's, um, I did self-harm the other day, too. Um, I'm okay. You know, I'm, I'm aware with my self-harm. Uh, it's not life-threatening self-harm. It never is. Um, but, uh, but it happens. It's like, for me, I look at mental health as like any other uh, disease or virus or whatever, right? Uh, if you get the flu, some people get uh, vomiting, some people get diarrhea, some people get uh, flu, like a uh, fever or the shakes. Some people are exhausted. Some people have the flu and nothing's wrong with them. Those jerks. <sighs> um, for me, with my mental health. Uh, my mental illness, uh, when it gets bad, I self-harm. Um, it's not, doesn't mean anything. It just means that I'm struggling. Um, I'm not suicidal. Other than that, I'm doing, I'm just doing. Um, but I wanted to make this video because uh, I wanted to show people, I wanted to talk to people about it. Um, I don't think I've showered yet this week. It's Thursday. I don't remember the last time I had a shower. Pretty much wore the same clothes. Uh, I haven't shaved. Um, in case you're <laughs> not aware, I'm transgender. And uh, so I do still get a bit of my beard. Um, usually just neck beard. So, I shave that, but I haven't. Um, and I've got no desire for anything. Uh, it's just gone. Just gone. I don't want to eat. Um, you know, when I don't want chocolate, that's a bad sign. I don't want to um, buy Lego. 
I don't want to build Lego. I don't want to read, even though I was reading uh, Stephen King's The Shining, because I'd only ever seen the movie by Stanley Kubrick, and Stephen King hated that version, so I wanted to read the book and actually see uh, what the book was like. Very different. Good. Better. Better. Um, but the visuals in the movie, oh man. Great big epic shots. Which is Kubrick. Um, my partner's keeping a good eye on me, and I'm doing good. They're, they're all right. They're, I'm not, I don't need to go to the hospital anytime soon. But the desire thing, man, it sucks. Like not having the desire to do anything. To get up, to go to sleep. All of that. Eating. Do I want to eat a chocolate bar? No, not really. Do I want to go out and spend money and buy Lego? No, not really. Do I want to... Uh, I don't want anything. And that's hard. That sucks. That really sucks. <sighs> so... But I did want to make this video. Um, I haven't been planning it. I just sort of was like, yeah, let's go make a video. So I could just talk to you guys. And, and share how I'm doing. Um, which is not good. I wish I could say more. Uh... I will be okay. I know that. Don't know how long it's going to take, but I will be okay. Um, I've been through this enough times now to, to know, but I don't know. I really struggle with, with the purpose in my life. You know, why am I here? I don't work. I haven't worked in probably 10 years. I'm only 37. I retired it before I hit my 30s. And I wasn't, I didn't choose to retire, I was forced into it by my mental health. I just can't do anything anymore. And I want to do things, you know, I want. I want to do things. I just don't know what, because I have no desires. Except the desire to do something. Make my life count for something. That would be nice. That would be nice. But I mean, I think it's a little bit late in my life to hope for fame or celebrity or money. Most people can, can sort of go, well, I've got my children or I've got my family. Um, I have children, but they don't live with me. Haven't for 10 years. And I don't talk to them often. I've been through two marriages. They've both destructed. I'm on my third life relationship. So... You know, all those things uh, that people say to, to comfort themselves. Or maybe they have God or religion. I grew up with God and religion. Both my parents are ministers in the church. And I saw what the reality of having God and religion means. It means family vacations canceled because somebody dies. And not suddenly, not a surprise, like some 92-year-old grandma who's been on her way to death's door for the better part of six months. Sermons, worship service, that's just a job. 
It's just something you gotta get up and, and do. You're just a public speaker. And what you talk about is, is God. And, you know, I got no issue with God. It just doesn't matter much to me. She's pretty distant. And I have no desire to be part of a faith community. Been there. Did that. They left me when I got when I needed support most. So what have I got? I've got one partner. No friends. The uh Pandemic means I'm basically a shut-in. I don't know anybody in town. We moved right before the pandemic. We moved in November of 2019. November 1st, 2019. We hadn't even unpacked fully when the pandemic came. And we went down to visit family for Christmas, which meant that we came back from the United States and there was nothing. Life stopped. Now, is it getting started again? Should it get started again like it used to? I'm worried about making people sick. So that's what's going on. I might make some videos, just something to keep me busy. So if you see those and you like them, it's great. Anyway, that's my life right now, and I think it's important to show it because. Alright. Try to have a good one. Grace out.